Hello and welcome to my channel. My name is Marie. I love Color Street and today <clears throat> I know it's not fall yet but I want to do this Manny in honor of our fall winter lunch that's going to be launching tomorrow the 23rd of August. So I'm going to be using Stay and Check. This is from the new collection that's launching. And then No Holding Black, which is a black glitter dip. You can see that, I'm not sure. The glare. And then this is Midnight in Manhattan. And yes, it is a previously open set. Disclaimer, these are one-time use only. Color Street will not guarantee them to be good after using them one time, sealing them, and trying to use them again. And let's see. Two of these out because I'm always forgetting them even if I take them out so you guys remind me <laughs> ha ha um okay so let's get started so I'm gonna start with oops not this one I'm gonna start with stay in check Ethanol. I was hoping for the other one because I need to wipe my nails down. Um, it is very important, in case you're new here, it's very important to uh, wipe your nails down with the alcohol pet pad or um, wash them with Dawn dish soap because yeah, to get all the oils off of your nail beds another ethanol um so that the nail strips stick and let's see i apologize i just need to grab an alcohol prep pad that i have handy here um i usually do wash them with dawn just so but I didn't today, so I'm just using a an alcohol prep pad that is not ethanol because ethanol can be extremely drying to the hands or nails, skin, all of the above. You want to prep your nails before you do any of that, and that's we're good to go. Okay. Now the hard decision is what to put on which nails. I cannot take full credit for this Manny because I did see it in an Elfie and I fell in love with it. I was going to just put this on anyway, <clears throat> but uh, then I saw that Nelfie and I thought, oh, that would be a perfect, I like the mixed Manny of it. So let's start with the pinky here and if you're new here welcome thank you for finding your way oh I like it already um, if you're not new here thank you for returning I'm excited about the launch. I just have to buy replacements for <laughs> all the sets that um, I, s oh, that's, so these are repositionable. If you don't stretch it out too much, taking it back off, which I don't have any base coats down on my nails so this nail is 
crooked. This pinky nail is a crooked nail. So that French that I did the right angle from the new fall winter line, it looked kind of funky on this crooked nail. My nail goes out that way. So I usually keep it a little shorter. Okay, so, oh, my hands. So I'm trying to decide if I, oh, you know what? I think I don't have one that would fit my, wait, I thought I had another pack here. Oh man. Oh well, I thought I had another pack that had a bigger one to do this. So I'm gonna have to do this on my ring finger. I have one that fits it. I swear I had two packs, so I'll try that one. See how that does. Oh, anyway, so, um, yeah, because I had mystery uh, bundles and amazingly the ones that all got drawn were the ones of course everyone's favorites pretty much so I'm gonna have to buy some more which is fine because it, the whole thing was just fun anyway I'm sorry hold on forgot the little cheater glasses here I try so hard to be all prepared I don't know what happens I get in a hurry I get all excited um Yeah, I'm excited about this fall launch. I really like, um, I really am liking this fall winter launch. A lot of the sets, a lot. Liking them a lot. <laughs> so, yeah. Don't really want to pick that off. Oh, okay. Oh, didn't stretch it to cover. That's okay. I can put another one to double it up. I normally put clear as day on when I only do one, but no one's going to know if I double this. So I will double my ring fingers up so I can make sure that I have all the coverage on here. And there's a little tiny hangnail. So what sets, if you've seen them, um, are you excited about, there we go, that's the, I, I pretty much like all of them. I thought about doing the, like, reddish orange, uh, what one is it? This. Carmine Shine. It's like a reddish orange, but I know I did uh, Baton Rouge not too long ago, so I was like, nah, I'm not gonna do that one. I do wanna put it on though and see what it looks like. I've seen Nelfies with it and they just look amazing, so. And I do like red. I've only, I think, worn Midnight in Manhattan one time before, and gosh, I like this. Okay, so next we will do... This, oh, I have a chip. I didn't see it. I'll have to fix it later.
static. Does anyone else use the make anchor method or is it just me that needs that stability of using the anchor method? That green is super pretty. I'm surprised at how many strips in here have the design on them. I love it. We have more of a variety to choose from. Oh, let me equal that. No, maybe I got it. Okay. Oh, so it's going to be long enough. It's a wrinkle. I might have to use the other one. I wanted to double it. Oh, it is long enough. I don't know what I was thinking. Just don't want the wrinkle in there. I love solids. I just love them. Or creams, they call, but I call them solids or creams. So pretty. Um, let me double that up. The ones with the designs, I don't really need to double up. I don't feel like, but these cream solid ones, I do. My thumb is so sore. Because, look at that, my nail broke right there. I just didn't want to cut it because my thumb is so tender. Um, does anybody watching, any of you subscribers do quilling? I've started it not too long ago. And I forgot how rough and hard paper is on your nails or I mean on your skin and um, that's what happened to my thumb oh look at it it's even peeling is that I was going hardcore last night with the quilling and paper and for hours and hours and it's like it broke my nail. My f skin is all hurting from it. I woke up today and couldn't figure out why my thumb was hurting so bad. But it was from doing the quilling. Do you know what that is? Um, so, I'm making a butterfly. And you, you roll the papers on a tool. So this is just the start of the butterfly. I gotta f still finish it, obviously. But that's part of it, that's quilling. Um, let's see, well, I made this flower, but this was one of my first things. One of my daughters was <laughs> looking at it and one of the things came off and, and I learned real quick that I need to use the clear glue for it. But this is a flower and another flower. I know this isn't color street related, huh? And then my favorites, ladybugs. Oh, aren't they so cute? I made these, so, yeah, that's a new hobby that I have, and I'm really enjoying it, except I'm just not enjoying my fingers or my thumb hurting so bad today. That's all. Okay, let's get back to business here. Let's see, use this one. Yeah. 
anyway, if any of you do quilling, let me know. And let me know where you buy your supplies. I've just been buying them on Amazon. Um, because they just seem, the prices seem right. I tried to look on Michael's website, but I couldn't find anything on there. I haven't thought, of, I didn't think about Joann's, or did I look at Joann's? Well, shoot, now I, no, what? Yeah, I think it was Michael's that I looked at. But, it's so relaxing to me. I love it. I'm just coming here in my office and quill away. Oh, my skin. I lotioned earlier. It's just like it's so dry. It's, at least we're, I think, for now, anyway, over to the heat wave. It's still hot, it's in the 80s, which to me is ridiculously hot still, but it's still better than 100 in high 90s. Still trying to decide for sure. Yeah, this would be, I think I'm going to use the big thumb. The big thumb. Um, still trying to decide really if I want to. Where's the other little tiny? Oh, it's, oh my gosh, it's still on there. Okay, no problem. Here's the big ones all the way. Okay. Oh. I'm going to put that on here. Open it just for one nail, but I really am liking it this way. I just can't decide, excuse me, if I want to put really on here. Help me decide. Yes, I'm going to do it. It's owed to fall, winter, launch, so hey, why not, right? Why not? Oh, so I didn't actually have to do two. Because I'm putting this on. Hello. <laughs> oh, boy. I don't know. I might have to use two strips of this, too. I'm not sure. <sighs> I want this to go on just right. There we go. Oh, I think I love it. I think I love it. Yes. So if you have chunky glitter and you get those little pieces like that, just leave them and use a nail clipper to clip them off or nippers because otherwise if you don't you're going to be pulling chunks of glitter out of your mani and it's going to have some bare spots in it so you don't want that <laughs> so i'm just going to tuck that under for now leave that oh i do like it super pretty a little extra right here Set that to the side and do my thumbs. Let's do this one. This strip. See if I can get both nails. I don't know if I can. So this one's gonna get cut down, so I might be okay. Let's 
So I've been using the next thumb down, but with the design on it, I didn't want to stretch it, ruin that design. You know what I'm saying? This is so not me, this Manny, but I, my tastes have really been changing and I really like it. I'm liking it. Okay, I'll just cut these little tiny tags off. Okay, oh my goodness. To me, I'm gonna have to cut that nail down. Don't want to because they're like growing. Not fit perfect though. Like this one is as long as it's been in a long time, if ever. Oh my gosh, that. <sighs> Uh, orange stick. So remember, you do want to do your thumbs last because you use them as a tool. So then you want to use a tool, an actual tool. Oh my goodness. That... So I need to not use the side of my thumb when I'm quilling. So if you're still here and you haven't subscribed to my channel, please consider subscribing. I am really am trying to build my channel up, um, trying to advertise it wherever I can. So please share my YouTube channel if you'd like to. Even if you wouldn't like to. No, I'm just kidding. See, and I forgot to do these again. See that? I almost got away without doing it. Yes. Yes, this one. I, anyone that does these, do you have a hard time centering this on there? Oh, my gosh. I think I already have. Nope, that's not it. A midnight. Look at that. Midnight in Manhattan. Yes. I guess I'll just have another one in case. Ay, ay, ay. I was thinking it was sitting out to put it on a stick. And then, duh, this isn't the new sticks. I mean, this isn't a new one to put on a stick. See how I just get all over the place? Anybody else like that? not even that late it's like 10 10 o'clock so we'll do this one and that one is that the one? Oh, that's the only other oh there's one it's probably the same do those Okay, as I was saying, does anyone else have a hard time putting these, getting them centered on here? I have the hardest time, so I've started doing it this way, and it seems to go better, but not always. See, it's still off a little. I just can't. I just can't, but it's okay, because it's still... You know, for the most part, it's on there. I'm going to do this one. So it goes with that one. What am I doing? There we go. 
go. Close enough. Don't really have a choice once it's on there. <laughs> Can't really take it off. Okay, I've got that and one more. Let's see. That one's not going to fit. Try this one. This one's a little wider, I think. Do it like that so you can see there we go all right i did it yay okay well i have a little bit of cleanup i will do off camera for this one with the chunky glitter i want to let it cure up for a little bit and done and that's it what do you think for a fall winter manny i am liking it hopefully my lighting is good all right, thank you for watching, and please like my video and subscribe to my channel. See you next time. Ciao.